guys, what's up? Thank you so much for watching and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to show you how I wash my brushes. I'm going to be using some Skylab products. Uh, it's a beauty brand that I'm partnered up with. And I'm going to be also using baby shampoo because it seems to work the best. It makes my brushes really soft. I'm going to be using a blotting towel, a drying stone, and also the silicone cups that Skylab offers on Amazon. So if you guys want to see how I wash my brushes, then please keep watching. Uh, dirty brushes. This is from Skylab. I have showed this in my videos before. First, I'm going to be using this silicone cup and putting baby shampoo. I always, always use Johnson & Johnson baby shampoo. You can get this on Amazon, uh, the big one for $5. So I put one pump in the cup with a little bit of water. And then I take my brush and I swirl it around. And there's little notches on the bottom of these cups that help clean your brush better. And then I run the water with this silicone cup that has holes in it. This cup really helps to get the soap out of the bristles. And then I take this blotting towel from Skylab. They have not come out with this yet, so I will let you guys know when they do. But I just kind of Tap the brush onto the towel, and then I take this drying stone, just open it up. It's literally like a stone slab. So I take my brush and I go like this, and then in circular motions, and this is supposed to help dry your brush so that you don't have to wait forever for it to dry. They also have not come out with this yet, but I will let you guys know again when they plan on launching this. It definitely did dry it a lot quicker than it would if it was just kind of laying out. That's the most annoying thing is when you wash a brush and you need to use it in the next like couple hours because it's always still a little damp. Wow, it actually did, it dried it quite a bit. Another way I like to clean my brushes is actually putting the soap into my hand, running the brush under water, and then swirling it around on my hand with the soap. So I'm gonna show you how I wash my beauty sponges. These are so fragile, they can easily tear, so I always use Johnson & Johnson baby soap on these as well. Also because my skin is really sensitive and baby shampoo just never seems to affect it in any way, so I usually use this. Some people use their face wash, but a lot of face wash has acne solution in it and it's gonna be very drying on the sponge and your sponge will not last as long. What I do is I actually put the soap directly onto the sponge. I do this a couple times. Run it under water and then I just massage the soap into the sponge. And then one more time. And I just keep squeezing the sponge until there's no more soap coming out. You can kind of feel it too. Still feel like there's a little bit of soap in there. Squeeze out the excess water 
And then you can take any towel, I'm gonna use the blotting towel, and just squeeze the sponge in different places of the towel so that it's completely dry. And then it's a perfectly beautiful sponge ready to use and it's a little damp so you can actually do this right before you use it too. That's it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you're not already. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.